We are going to compare 5 eighths and 2 sixths using rectangular area models. Here in our comparison, we have two fractions with different numerators and different denominators. So when we partition our whole for 5 eighths, the sizes of each part is going to look different than our parts for 2 sixths because they have different denominators. So we're going to take the whole here and partition it into 8 equal parts. Then we're going to partition this hole into six equal parts. Now for the hole representing the five eighths, we need to shade in five of those holes or five of those equal parts. And down here, we're going to represent two of those six. We're going to shade in two of those six equal parts. So we can now see five eighths is greater than two six. So let's write our comparison statement five eighths. And two six, we know five eighths is the greater value. So using my greater than, less than, or equal to symbols, I know five eighths is the greater value. So I'm going to have my symbol open to the five eighths. And now we can read it five eighths is greater than two six.